Good evening. Happy Friday. Uh, <laughs> if it sounds like I'm brain dead, it's because I am. Uh, I'm still struggling with the sleep schedule, but today, instead of just trying to fall back asleep and sleeping away more rest of the day, I got I got stuff done today, which was nice. Uh, did a bunch of cooking, took care of some other um, miscellaneous little things here and there I needed to take care of, but um, running a little low on steam. <laughs> so I, I figured... I'm probably not in the right energy bracket or mindset to uh, finish Resident Evil 4. So I'm going to do that tomorrow afternoon. Um, but tonight, I figured we'd dip into a little bit of Dredge. I saw a little bit of this game the other day. And I was like, oh, this is pretty neat. And I saw every aspect of it except the dredging. And then I saw the dredging. I'm like, oh, that's also neat too. I like the, the building. It, it also reminds me of another game uh, called... Uh, Sunless Skies, I think. Sunless Sea is, I think, the series or something. I don't know, but this reminded me of a very, like, not as, it's, it's Rimworld, it, what Rimworld is to Dwarf Fortress is what Dredge is to Sunless Seas. I don't know. This seems a lot more uh user-friendly to get into, so... I figured, what the hell? Let's do it. Oh, and the, and the title of the stream, you can tell I'm tired. <laughs> I'm like, dredge? More like hedge clippers, and then I'm like, that doesn't make sense. The title also still doesn't make any sense. Anyway, we're going to get into this. Job listing. Angler wanted. Is that me? Dredging the depths. This just came out too, I believe. Morning light fills your eyes. As you try to sit upright. You're lying on the, the cold, wet dock where you collapsed the night before. The short man is shouting orders at a handful of workers, disembarking from a boat nearby. The man notices you. Welcome to Great Morrow. Morrow. I must say, quite the dramatic first impression. I see you've already in introduced yourself to the jagged rocks along the bay. Did you not see the lighthouse? It was shining right at you. Ah, oh, well. I'm glad you to see our new fisherman upright and breathing. Your boat was hopelessly damaged, but I had a few of the locals move your things onto one of our old vessels. We'll catch up later to discuss more details. I'll let you get out of there. Out of, I'll let you get out there to catch some fish. See if you can fill your cargo while you get your bearings in the light. Hmm. Finally, I don't suppose you, I need to say this, but get back by sundown before the fog rolls in. Keep a close eye on the time. It could really creep up on you. Ooh, dear. Okay. <gasps> oh, yes. I, I recall this now. Moving equals time. <laughs> Fish. Just like super hot, yeah. <laughs> but if super hot, but boat. Oh, I depleted it. Okay. Oh, we keep fishing. I don't have the right equipment. Okay, that's cool. 
What was this? Okay. Oh, I have to... It's one of those tutorials. Uh-oh. I hurried on to fishing. <laughs> Boy. Fish. There you go. Okay. It's fish Tetris. Fishtress. Ah, uh, damn it. You're taking others. Okay, I don't have enough stuff for this. Okay, that's fine. Ooh, trophy caught. Okay. Thank you for this prime sub. I do deeply appreciate it. Hope things are good on your end. I have lights. Oh, I I have lights. Like this. Can I, no, I can't judge that. I'm doing okay. I'm tired. <laughs> I'm trying to get my sleep schedule back on. On track. Oh, I need to go back. Uh, oh. Oh, I can't see shit. Okay. Uh, oh, th those are rocks. This is very much Sea of Thieves now. It causes panic. Okay. Bright lights and sleeping will reduce it. Let's see. Oh, cabin fish for the day. I caught a lot of fish. August 20th, 1927. Morning of the second day of the honeymoon our, and our first day proper. Today we're sailing around the islands and the inlet and inlets at the back of Great Morrow. I love the rocks here. The layers and colors are so striking. Furthermore, the fishing is relatively poor in these shallows, so I know you'll keep his hands on the wheel instead of on the rods. He renamed the boat last night, Julie. He did a fancy renaming ceremony and everything. I think he took that more seriously than the wedding. Supposedly, it's very important to perform it correctly, unless you want ill fortune to follow the vessel. He wanted to throw it away everything with the old name on it, but I kept the keychain. Ocean's Riches it was a good name. I think he prepared a surprise picnic lunch. I can see the basket half hidden, stuffed under a blanket, at the front of the cabin. I love it when he tries to be romantic. Oh, nice. I have L-shaped fish, cod. <laughs> Blue mackerel. All right. Dock. Step onto the dock at great, Greater Morrow. Do I call it Great Morrow this entire time? It's supposed to be Greater? Brain. The mayor is waiting nearby. Ah, I see you've returned in one piece. Very good. Before you head off to town, we should discuss the matter of your boat. As I mentioned earlier, your old boat was too badly damaged to be repaired. However, I'm more than happy to sell you the replacement vessel, yours to own. I understand you may not have necessity, necessary funds on hand, but we'll consider it a loan. But I want to make this easy for you. Until your debt is repaid, a tiny portion of your fish sales will go towards paying it off. A small amount of interest will go towards improving the town. So to recap, you'll need to sell fish at the local market, paying off your debt and in turn keeping the population fed and satisfied. Understand? Uh, selling the fish helps out. Keep, helps 
pay off my debt. Got it. Where do I sell fish? This game does look fun. Like I, it, it, it just it took me like a ten minute watch of like a, someone else playing it. I'm like, all right, I I can I can get with this. This is definitely something I want to get into. Off you go then. Sell those fish while they're still fresh. Go to the fishmonger. You enter a squalid shack in the fringe of the marketplace. The familiar smell of fish fills the air. Flies buzz haphazardly around the downcast man behind the counter. Hmm. You're the new fisherman, eh? Surprised they found a new one so fast. What happened to the other one? He... It takes a certain type of person to last out here. Not a life for everyone. Anyway, to business. I'll pay you for fish. Bigger and fresher means more money. Some species are just worth more too. Other towns and other islands may pay different. But while you still got debt outstanding here, I suggest you work on paying it off first. Well, let's see what you got. I can sell all my fish for $131. Ooh. All right. Why do I make games look so fun? The games are fun. I just show them. <laughs> <They've> been... <laughs> you put some pizza in the oven? Is it a tower of pizza? Can it be? <laughs> the mayor standing outside the fishmonger store. Excellent work. I have no doubt you'll be able to provide for this town. Look here. I found this down by the docks. I'm sure it's someone like you can make something out of it. Why don't you take it? Research part. Okay. It's a meatball one. Ooh. Oh, one last thing. Our local shipwright mentioned she might be able to make some modifications to your ship. You should pay her a visit. Okay. As you walk in the yard, you see the shipwright making repairs on the, to a damaged hull. She looks up at you briefly before turning back to her work. Ah. You must be the new fisherman. I can make improvements to your vessel in the yard. Mind you, I'm not in the... What? Runius! Hello! Hi, Cap'n! <laughs> How's it going? Thank you for the follow. Mind you, I'm not in the business of doing favors around here. Payments up front, and everything takes some time to install. Also, if you take any damage from the rocks or any damage at all, I can patch it up. Mostly. She shrugs and gestures towards the hull she's currently attempting to repair. A number of wooden boards, all well above the waterline, are splintered and scratched. Take a look around. Just remember, the bigger the equipment, the longer it takes to install. So plan ahead. I'm just popping to check out dredge. Nice. What this? This be dredge. You, you go fishing and you sell fish. <laughs> Okay. Oh. So this does... What does this do? Wait. This does coastal catching. Oh, this is shallow catching. Do I want to do this? Oh, there's more. Oh, lo I'm loving this. Troll nets. Oh, I can go... Okay. All right. Let's, let's do this so we can get... Uh, Yeah, let's do this. Let's get this for now. Oh, okay, so look, it takes two hours to install. So I lose time. Ah, uh, okay. So now I can catch coastal and shallow. Okay. I don't know what storage is, but this... Oh my god! <laughs> Turn to town. Alright. Um, I guess we can... Let's research. Research parts. Oh! That just does both of them. Oceanic. Ooh. Oh, maybe I should have got that. Hold on. How much are you? Four hundred dollars. Oh my god. First they, first they tell me my boat's unrepairable, and next they're trying to fucking con me into providing for the town. Oh, no, 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 no. Talk. Let's uh rest until dawn. 
let's uh let's go fishing <laughs> Loading buoy. It serves as a, to mark a safe passage past dangerous rocks and obscured hazards. Its dim light also provides brief respite in the gloom of the night. All right, can I can I catch this stuff now? You bet your ass I can. Ooh, golf flounder. That's a big fish. I don't know if it's a bad thing if I'm depleting things. So I'm going to leave things at low stock and I'll come back to them. Because, uh, uh, I think it tells me that's not good. Ooh, high stock. Okay. Shit. Back roll. Okay. Actually, let's... There. Yeah. Serving wildlife. Oh. Trophy. Okay, so it's getting low. I'll let them rebuild their numbers. Build their numbers. I'm also very tired for those just popping in. So if I stop making any sense more so than usual, then that's exactly why. Ever go fishing at the fold the fish into the slots? Is this something? Can I do this? Is this something better? Oh, I can. Oh no, I can't catch one more. Shoot. Let's see if I can catch another <laughs> bendy fish, which is a cod. Uh, it's, I don't have room for that. Okay. Oh, I see. Oh, there's a list of all the fish I can catch. That's going to be dangerous. Alright, let's head back. Other than the fact that I might have overfished that one cod spot, I think I did pretty good. I mean, that's a pretty full haul there. Oh, I'm starting to panic. Eyeballs out. <sighs> I had a special order come in through the through from a customer. If you can fulfill it, I'll pay above normal prices. Yes, please tell me. One golf flounder, one gray eel. Just bring them when you got when you have them. You'll need to have a rod that can handle shallow water fish in order to catch those. The shipwright should be able to sort that out for you. I have that. You only got a fish for I do. Just leave whatever you have. Put the order on the table. Okay. Uh here's a golf flounder. And I'll have to find that. Alright, come back when you have everything. Now, down to regular business, eh? Which, how you do it every day. Those old, these old bones wouldn't cut it on the high seas. Yar. <laughs> You're in the town. How much money have I got now? Um. Uh. Oh, for another one of these? Let me see, what's my research situation? Oh, I need more research parts for that. Okay. Because this one I can do both on the. Okay. okay. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha.
I need to go find some eel in shallow water. All right, let's rest. What the hell's that? Punch woman approaches you from the steps of the lighthouse. She stops some distance away and looks at you with concern and visible apprehension. Ah. Why are you here? Uh, I've come to fish. Ah. There's nothing here for someone like you anymore. Do yourself a favor and move on. He turns and shuffles back along the path that leads to the light. Well, <laughs> just the person I was hoping to see. Will you be sailing out east towards Little Morrow? Will you give this package to the dock worker there, please? Uh, am I a mailman now? The mayor hands you a small, damp package bound in string. It's dripping slightly. It's fish! No. <laughs> The dock worker will pay you upon delivery. Please be quick about it. I don't want it to spoil. It is fish. Don't forget to check your compass and map if you get lost. Uh, okay. Map. Oh. Okay, so I just have to go. I think I was there earlier. Deliver the package. Oh no. I think I like this game. Yeah, I'm going to need to get a new engine. Put another one of those rusty suckers on there. Look at the wind squiggles. I'm going with the wind. This is definitely not seeing these. I love if you can actually see the shape of the fish in the water, too. You know what you're getting into. All right. I've arrived. Hmm? What? Delivery? Let's see here. There's a small hole in the paper and peeks inside. Can't say for sure, but it feels as though he's shielding it from your view. Yeah, nice and fresh. This will do nicely. I'm to pay you, I suppose. He has you some money. Ooh, 25 bucks. I was given this old book a few weeks back, but it didn't make much sense to me. You'll surely get more use out of it. Pulls out a crumpled book from his back pocket and hands it to you. Number of pages are folded over. Keep it in your cabin. Perhaps you can read it while you're on the water. Stop by for a chat anytime. I know how lonely it can be. Oh. Okay. Oh, that's right. I remember this mechanic. You just start reading books, and then you get perks as you sail around. Because you're just sailing around reading books. It feels very much like... Uh, oh, what's that zombie game? Project Zomboid when you're reading books to get skills and stuff. Trader, uh, enter a brightly lit shop. It's packed with antiques. The shelves are full of jewelry and other baubles. An old man peers at you over silver spectacles. Ah. Hello? Is that? No. Ah, uh, I don't believe we've met. Forgive me, my eyes aren't what they used to be. I specialize in antiques and jewelry. I'll purchase any special trinkets you may have. Have you anything nice with you today, perhaps? How about my shitty engine? <laughs> nope. I'll just row home. God, could you imagine? Alright, let's try and find an eel. Where would one find an eel? Also, this music's really good. It's just very chill. eels over here? These aren't really shallows, are they? No, these are... Are these eels? This looks more like... aerials? I need dredge. I've got no dredge. Ooh, what's back here? I like this little tugboat. You know what it reminds me of? It, it uh, reminds me of the, the 3D printer pest model. I forget what it's called. Hey, that looks like a eel. 
Oh, that's dirty. As you can tell, I don't play Dead by Daylight at all in the slightest. <laughs> oh no, I depleted it. Damn it. I was I was so excited with the new mechanic. Shit. Alright, well, let's go back. We'll hand in the what we got. Encyclopedia. Oh wait, hold on. Yeah, okay. This that's cool. Uh I'm still reading it. 38%. Nice. Let's let's fish a little bit more on our way back in. Oh, that's low stock. Ugh. What is that shine? The lighthouse towers above. Waves crash endlessly against the perilous rock below. All creatures, human or otherwise, would have their brittle bodies broken and thrown at its feet. You ponder the intrinsic power of the structure, a vast column of stone shouldering the responsibility of countless lives. How long will it stand? How long will it until it decays into ruin, its purpose exhausted? Lighthouse towers above. Ah, damn it. So I gotta fix this now. Interesting. Okay. sell things first. You got any fish for the order? Yes, I do. Leave it here. Leave whatever you have here. Okay, let's give them this one. Ooh. Fishmonger wraps up the fish and hands you some money. Good, good. They should be pleased with these. We got another order here. A little, just a little more curious. We want a couple squid and a whole black grouper. Black bass? No. <laughs> Don't see many people fishing squid these days. They only feed at night. And well, you know what nights are like around here. Good luck. I don't know how you do it. Don't. Hold. Oh, it, I, I got it. Okay, so it breaks a. Ooh, okay, it breaks a. It breaks a grid. Interesting. All right, let's get that fixed. Both mm. looking a little banged up. I can repair that here if you like. Yes, please. Repair mode. Oh, okay. Shallow, shallow. Uh, let's get another one of these. In two hours. Nice. It feels like the waiting the extra eighty bucks is going to be worth it. Two arrow squid, one black grouper. Well, let's go out now and see if we can get that. Uh... Oh, hell yeah. Now we're hauling ass. Oh, shit. It's right here. Okay, so it's low. Uh, maybe we'll come back for it. We got the two we needed for the order, so that's fine. This is cabin talking about. Hey, we're almost 60% six, complete that book. Oh. Cool. Oh, cool. It even tells you... That's like Animal Crossing. <laughs> Pizza! Very nice. I do have fish for the order. So that's what that... I like it gives you this outline of what it looks like so you can look for it if you're too lazy like me. Alright. Let's 
get back out there. Uh, did it say where the groupers were? Oh, uh, groupers only fight at night. Unless it's only the squid. Let's try coming out here. That looks like, yeah. Stuff I can't do yet. Oh. Ooh, what are these? Can I catch them? Damn it. Huge. <laughs> it's more debris. Now, now I'm worried about overfishing things, and I'm wasting all of my time during the day. Let's go over here. Let's see what this island's about. I do feel a little bit faster, but there's a lot of fish here. Shop looks like looks as this as though it hasn't been used in decades. Go inside, take a moment to let your eyes adjust to the dim light. What do I do here? Pick up items. Find some horrifying creations among the detritus. Arterial engine. Okay, sign of ruin. A symbol of the deep carved into its small talismans. Sure to draw the attention of those attuned to it. Oh, I think I know what this is. This is part of the, I think the deluxe edition or something I picked up. Okay. Oh, I see. So this replaces seven knots, 14 knots, 10 knots. So, bony blades of this grotesque engine are driven by a pulsing heart. It beats in time with your own. Ooh. I'm gonna put it in storage for now. What do I wanna do here? Let's uh, keep efficient then. Come on. Not uh... sustainable fishing. Ten percent chance not to reduce fish stocks when catching a fish with a rod. Ooh. Okay. I like that. Or folded cod. That's that's not. I don't trust. I'm gonna get that ten percent. <laughs> Damage peculiar engine disabled. No, a rock came out of nowhere. Okay, we're gonna need some lights. 
because holy hell, that was bad. Mayor's walking quickly towards you. He seems to be in a good mood. We'll just bring in a step. Fantastic news! Thanks partly to your efforts, Greater Morrow is growing. Our town is sure to be swarming with visitors any day now. In fact, I've granted the consent of, for the shipwright to expand her facilities. The old dry dock is operational again. I've also allocated some money to improve the fishmonger services. They might have something to talk to you soon about. Talk to you about soon. Keep up the good work. We're glad you've chosen to be here with us. It feels like I don't have a choice. But this is dry dock. We can make significant improvements to your vessel here. Talking extra space, more attachment points for equipment, even superior hulls. Ooh. Really a decent stock of hard materials for these projects. Lumber, metal scraps, that sort of thing. Now we get materials. There's plenty of decent materials around the coast for various shipwrecks and the like. I'm sure you'll find a way to get them, uh, get at them. Materials assigned towards upgrades will be here. Upgrades here will be stored. So don't worry if you only have half of what you need. Okay. Odd spaces, that spaces. Oh, okay. So it's like the fish. Okay. Oh, and I gotta buy it. Oh my god. All right. Uh, ship right. You guys were lit up with a weird crimson glow the other night. Did you see it? I did see it. I said, what the fuck? Uh, let's get that light. <laughs> Alright, and then let's return to town. Go to sleep. Nice. Oh, that's right. New message. We had a slight accident yesterday around the shallows at the back of Greater Morrow. A rock seemingly appeared out of nowhere and struck the front of the boat. It did not penetrate the hull, but it did jostle us around. A few items fell overboard in the water. We did not see what they were, which is of some concern, but we believe all important articles are accounted for. He's been checking over some notes from the boat renaming ceremony. He's paranoid that he performed the steps incorrectly. I've never known him to be so superstitious. Okay. So this feels like a little bit like a uh, money grind. I say ooh because it's a uh, it was high stock. Big boy. Oh, barbed eel. Why did it make that sound? A spine broken with sharp angles and crooked curves. A robe, teeth bent on revenge. Okay. I saw a shark. <laughs> I mean, these kind of look like sharks. They're really big. But I don't have the right equipment for it.
aberrations. Oh, okay. Grotesque fish. Show the fishmonger. Okay. Dolphins. This just turned into a puzzle game. <laughs> Back to the shore. Thank you, Solano. <laughs> Imagine you have to constantly keep rearranging your fish in the the in your in your ship. What is it today? You hand, over, you hand the grotesque fish to the fishmonger. He grins, raising the fish up to his face before inhaling a deep, stuttering breath. Oh. Ah, now this is the sort of specimen I've to liven my, up my day. Hmm, wonder. He runs his fingers firmly along the length of the fish, as though feeling for something. He pushes from one side of its stomach. A small shape can be seen against the bulging scales. He slices the fish open. From its stomach, he pulls a small piece of fabric and spreads it on the counter. A delicately patterned handkerchief. Well, I've never seen that before in all my days. I'll give you this thing. And I'll pay for the fish too, of course. It's not the first corrupted fish I've seen in these parts, so if you... I'm sure if you find more before too long, I'll pay you well if you find any more. Okay. Once beautiful handkerchief drawn from the insides of a grotesque fish, patterned with the delicate... The threat. Okay. The man is looking at you through the cabin window. His face is mostly in shadow. I know what you took to the fishmonger. I'll be clear. I know he extracted the artifact from it. I need to inspect it, but not here. Hmm. Keep me on Blackstone Isle. Head out of this bay and cut south. I have a business proposition that you'll want to hear. I'll be waiting. Okay. Ah. If you want to get a little bit more out of your engines, take a look through this book. On the house. Oh. It pulls a book from the toolbox nearby and hands it to you. A few pages are stuck together with grease. Okay. Ah, I'm still short. Okay, that's fine. Uh, what's my storage? Oh, okay. So this is still... I wonder what this does. I have another research? I don't think I do. I don't have any research parts. <gasps> you can do engines. Lots of nets. Ooh, okay. How do I get them? I don't know. I just sort of found them last time. Let's get that uh, going. 
go to Blackstone. We got lights. We can do that now. Maybe we'll find some uh, groupers. Oh, what the hell is this? Oh, brood squid. I hate that sound. It, it's good sound, but my god, is it unsettling. Was the shiny the meaning? There's like the grotesque. Oh, it's depleted. That's fine. Blackstone Isle was that one. Must have been the wind. <laughs> the man is standing in a doorway, watching you approach. He's holding an old book in one hand. It's bound in crimson with silver ribbons. You came. Good. Allow me to introduce myself. I am a collector of many things. Art and artifacts, treasure and truths, and curios that occupy the periphery of desire. And you have some... And you have something for me. You give the handkerchief to the collector. He holds it up to the flickering light and studies it. <sighs> These patterns are unmistakable, even after all this time. This handkerchief comes from an old ship I've been searching for. It sank many years ago. It carried items of great importance. As you can imagine, retrieving them is proving to be quite challenging. That's where you come in. My proposition is this. I will outfit your vessel with equipment that will let you dredge wrecks and dark depths. Ooh, yes, please. Find me these lost relics, and I will reward you in ways beyond all imagining. Oh, he's gonna turn me into a Cthulhu. Why? Why does that? Th those incentives always sound so like <laughs> you're not you're not coming out ahead on this. You need not to give up your fishing career. I merely need a few hours with your vessel to make up make the necessary alterations. What do you say? I accept. An excellent decision. I'll prepare the equipment immediately. The relics we're looking for are a ring, a necklace, a watch, and a music box, and key. I would encourage you to ask around the towns about shipwrecks and other strange occurrences. Anything that might be worth investigating. Return when you have something. Slammed door shut in my face. Oh, fine. Squid. Physical sprout from a gelat uh, a glowing core inside a gelatinous sack. Other cores lay dormant alongside. Which relics. Oh, okay, so it tells you where it is. Morrow's Gale Cliff, Stellar Basin, Dell's Room. Okay. Let's uh, rest here. Does that mean I can grab these things now? Oh, these are coastal. These are folded cods. Um, can I catch this one? Oh. Oh, dredge. Okay, so these these are still oceanic folded cod. I mean, okay, they're like bent, bent cod. I, I think the fish go bad, so I'm going to go sell them, and then I'll go back out and dredge. Mm -hmm. Any fish for that order? Not right now. Hold on to the fish for now. Found this book out back. Could be useful to you. 
Fishmonger reaches and the kind of hands you a damp, battered book. A few shimmering fish scales are stuck to its cover. Oh, it's stale. No. It's stale fish. Variable stuff? Yeah. Lighthouse keeper. <sighs> what is it? You have any shipwrecks around here? She eyes you suspiciously. Mm. There's a spot near the back of Greater Morrow where the current carries in the wreckage from the sea. Some nights you can see an unnatural glow rising from that patch of dark water. I can't imagine what's down there in the deep. If you're looking for what I think you're looking for, it's best you just move on. Okay. Any weird happenings? I see plenty of strange things from atop the White House. Sometimes I don't know whether or not I can trust my own eyes. He holds the lantern up so it shines brightly onto your face. Are you really standing there in front of me? Or is this just another fog's tricks? Okay. Builder. You approach a woman sitting on the dockside, staring out to sea. She turns to you. What's it like out there? I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> Just shut down the conversation. It's peaceful. Gotta be a damn sight better than this bloody town. I think I'll need to get away for a while. Maybe not come back. Going backwards is a mistake, don't you think? You should always keep moving forward. Moving along. Uh, it's not so bad here. It'd be really funny if there was an alternate ending that would just... <laughs> yeah, it's like, I just fished. There is nothing else here. And it's just like the skies are burning red and just you're just sitting by your your, your rods. You're just like, yep, this is the life. <laughs> She's gazing out to the sea again, lost in thought. Say, if you find me some materials, maybe you can help me move? I mean, really move. There's an island I've heard about. Steel point, just to the north. Two units of lumber and two units of scraps, all I need. I can make a new place for myself there. You'd be welcome to visit too. Yeah. Just stack it up at Steel Point when you have anything. I'll pay when the job's done. Okay. Rods and reels and rakes. Cool, I gotta keep reading. Place the rest. Okay. Map. Okay, so I was told about these two little things. Let's uh, go dredging. What's E? Oh, E is this. <laughs> oh. Oh my goodness, okay. Gulf flounder, cod. Interesting. Let's just stick with the lights for now. <laughs> Let's go get some materials. I think today's just gonna be about materials. How much money we got? 280. Still not enough for uh creep stuff sadly goes away the more you absolutely <laughs> resolutely dump it back into the ocean. <laughs> yeah. That'd be great. It's like, oh that's weird. Back you go. Catch anything weird there? Yeah, I did. Where is it? Oh, it's back there. Oh I got it. Ooh. I'm picking a lock. Interesting. I got some wood. Like in Dredge, I just can't. Ocean. Is this scrap? Hell yeah. More. Nice. What the fuck is this? A slab of rock juts from the water, bearing a crude symbols of a curved fish at its base. At its base, a rough shape has been chiseled away. Curved fish, eh? I think I know exactly what folded fish might fit into that fucking thing. <laughs> Alliteration's hard when you're tired. What's this? 
<laughs> All that's left this old boat is an old house. Can you pull it a little closer. Look inside. <gasps> There's things inside. Oh, we're going to take all the things. Hey, research parts. Okay, so that's how you just find them. Citrine ring. Old iron chain. Cool. Oh, so <laughs> hey, Shadow, how's it going? It's like Sonic, burger. No, Sonic likes chili dogs. What are you talking about? It's like, oh, Sonic, the fast food chain. I got it. Oh, wait, I need these things. Shit, this is going to be a problem. Uh, okay, catch one. Uh, uh, uh. Hey, hey. Black grouper. Okay, I don't have enough. No, no, he's a hedgehog. Oh, okay. Uh, I think so. Let me double check. Uh, I don't know if that's... Is that Stellar Basin? It didn't really pop up. Oh, Stellar Basin's all the way over here. There's no way that's what it was. I do have fish for that order. Here you go. Fishmonger wraps the fish up and hands you some money. Mm. Didn't think you had it in you. Night fish is a tall order. I mean, I talked about a new business venture I've been considering. Crab pots. Ooh. Mm. I've got one here for you, in fact. It's a little banged up, but you can get fixed at the shipwright. Take my broken trash and fix it yourself at your expense. <laughs> Should be pretty straightforward. Just drop it in the sea anywhere. Come back after a day or two and check on it. Oh, okay. Got a customer after a fiddler crab and a common crab. Both species can be found around here. Oh, I can buy more. Hundred bucks. Oh, I don't have lousy weather lately. Almost makes you want not want to get out of bed. But you and I, we gotta do it, eh? We're what keeps people. We're what keeps people from going hungry. I realize I caught no fish today. Only. Uh... Uh, I have not finished it. I decided I was gonna take. Uh, I. I had like low energy tonight, so I'm gonna finish it tomorrow, uh, probably later afternoon. Um, yeah, I figured I'd just take it a little bit easy tonight. But uh, we're almost done. We're like at the very end. Like I think maybe we're like one and a half chapters away from finishing it. Uh, remember, you don't have to store all the materials all at once. You can store whatever you have right at the dry dock. Okay. Uh, what am I looking for? Better engines, net spaces. Bolt of cloth. I don't have cloth. Broad spaces. No cloth, huh? Modifies two cargo spaces to. Oh, I see. So it moves it. Okay. Two engine spaces. Ooh. A okay. light space. Okay, so it highlights it green. Cool. Wow. I think I have enough stuff for the. Um, thing though. The other lady wanted to move, right? Grouped F4 engine. Ooh. Oh, I can. Five days. Large crab pot. Drop it off an island. Yeah, yeah. Grouped airport engine. I mean, I kind of need to do this, right? Yeah. Now I have to go buy it. <laughs> Some of your equipment can use some fixing. We can repair that. Oh, yeah, that's right. I gotta repair this damn thing. Repair all. There you go. That's better engine. You do. 200 bucks. Can I sell these? Oh, I can. This will be on par. 
Oh, for 400 bucks. Uh, I was waiting for something for 400 bucks. Yes. Uh, I'd have to give up something. Damn it. All right. Get those for now. We're faster than we can get around. Better, okay. We'll rest and we'll go drop off the stuff tomorrow. Oh, that's right. You can set up a crab pot. Play with E. Yeah, let's put one right here. Buck. Oh, at a depth. Of, okay, so it. Oh, I get it. Okay. Where are you? Yep. Let's see. Plenty, plenty, plenty. Let's put it out here. It looks like a little. Four, five, six, seven, eight, eight, four, eight, six, eight, eight, six. Eight, six looks like it was the best we could do. All right. Uh, let's figure out where we have to go. Yeah. North, looks like. Yeah. Oh, did I read the book yet? Almost read the book. Uh, pursuits. Oh, yeah. Okay. So you three spot multi use fishing rod. Yes. Hey, just stop by for a moment to see to, to go take a nap. Nice. Enjoy your nap. Injured by five percent more ooh, speed than listed. Ooh. Alright, well let's read some. It's like I can catch some fish on the way there. Nope. I got a full, full thing. There's a doctor. Material pile. Is that only where the builder wants materials? You shall have it. We delivered all the necessary materials. We should let the builder know. All right. Uh, it looks like I, I could research anywhere. Um, some of this stuff here. I'm just getting treasure. Interesting. I could sell this, right, for money? Oh, I'm not going to make it back in time for today. Well, that fish is going to go bad. lately uh how about these things Oops. okay oh baby father hello is everything okay you have any shipwrecks around here well yes you see my only son was lost at sea some years ago he's still out there somewhere in one of those wrecks all alone in the cold dark water. The man is clearly trying his hardest to remain composed, but tremors of grief rack his body. I was wondering, I noticed you have some dredging equipment installed in your vessel. If you're able to retrieve any of his belongings from the wreck, I think he'd feel more at peace if his mementos were with me. He wore a bronze belt buckle, specially engraved. I'd recognize it anywhere. If there's a chance you can find it, 
I'll be in your debt. Anything else I can help you with? I better go. <laughs> Very pretty. Oh, snag squid. Gross. That's enough. <laughs> I got some extra lumber. What can I start working on? Uh, more broad spaces, net spaces, two engine spaces. Let's maybe increase our broad area. I guess I could have talked to the builder before I rested. Ah. You've done it? Well, no, since it's a waste of time. Let's get moving. Ha ha. Ha Greater and see you, great, greater morrow. I'm onward bound. You're allowed on my ship, but you have to be upside down. It's the rule. I'm the captain. Funny. You have to lie down with your head towards the back of the ship. It's the only way it works. <laughs> also, I'm going to catch all this fish. Make sure there's uh, enough space around you. <laughs> Seasick <clears throat> seasickness prevention, you see. There's a lot of stuff over here. Ah. Yes, yes, that'll do. Thank you, Bella. Give me a short while to get things built here. You're welcome to come back anytime. You should toolbox and pulls out a handful of components. Yeah. Take these. Always good to have on hand. Hey, okay. Thank you kindly. Uh... Okay. Oh, and then these do. And that does all of the. Oh, okay. What do I have now? I have coastal and shallow. So. That means the this will do both of them in one, and then this will be oceanic. So I can have three types going at a time. Neat. Okay. All right. Okay. enjoying this game so far. This is definitely going to be like a, be a morning stream. Ooh, a goblet. Uh, I don't think I need scrap at the moment. Probably get back. Okay, so if that's steel, then what's this? Mm -hmm. 
Oh, clock. Just a research part. Okay. Nice. Oh, I'm gonna... Fuck. Ghost boat? Uh, I ain't, I ain't fucking around with ghost boat. Just zooming around. Let's, uh... Let's go around the other side a little tomorrow. We'll see what we can pull up there and then we can sell stuff at, uh, Little Marrow Port. I like how I've stopped fishing for, like, a week. <laughs> I have space, but I have enough space. I should have enough space. Looks like a lot of stuff there. A lot of cloth involved in a lot of those upgrades, so I'm gonna make sure I get as much as I can. belt buckle okay pursuit update okay so if i do get a key item it will be um it will update it scrap that's a big chunk all right i'll get that scrap might as well as we're here. I do not have enough space for another one at this time. Ghost boat still out here? Got that belt buckle. Yes. Get the belt buckle to the old man. This this is this is his. Oh thank you. Bless you. You've returned him to me. Please take this. I have I have not any money to pay you, but this might hold some value to you. Anything else I can help you with? I told you all I know about shipwrecks. Alright. Fair enough. Uh, oh. F to sell. Oh. Okay, good. I did not sell those things. Okay, return to town. Search. 
I want advanced pots, though. Or better engines. The rods also seem like they're also really handy to have. I think upgrading the pots actually might be worthwhile. This one lasts the longest. This one holds the most. What's the point, what's the point of this one? Two to three per day. Okay, so it catches more. Oh, okay. Interesting. Let's, uh... Try this one. We'll go check on our, uh... Grab pot. enough <laughs> one hour remaining oh I don't have enough space for it I'll come back oh 10% chance to not reduce fish stocks when catching fish with a rod sustainable fish. oh no rod will reel in fish 10% more fish oh nice I got the crabs. These will do nicely. Glad you got to some use out of that old pot. You can always buy more here and repair damage on the shipyard. Uh, phone file request for you. As you've seen, some fish around here can develop odd deformities. What do you think happens when a person eats that flesh? Eats the flesh of one of those these mutants? Uh, they go mad. <laughs> well, perhaps. But I want to know for sure. Bring me a mutant fish. Any will do. Just keep this between the two of us. Okay. 150 bucks. Take, oh, I can take it out too. Nice. Okay. Maybe we'll do this. Get some nets going. Ah. Nets. Okay. Catch us coastal. Passively catch basic fish while deployed. A wise investment for those who want to explore the oceans. 250 bucks! Okay. <laughs> um, let's put it in storage. Let's put this in storage. And this in storage for now. Um, One of my things I'm trying to do is I'm trying to have fix my I wouldn't say metabolism, but I eat like meals at various times of the day, which is not good. I'm trying to be a bit more structured about it, so I might uh, call it shortly and then we'll have an actual proper dinner. Okay, so it still works if it's if it's not in my immediate inventory. Okay, had abyssal and had all. Goodness. to 
I'll make some money then. Folded card. Right now, like all I think is about is using the card to make origami sushi. She had the one cursed eye. <laughs> yeah. Right. I do like there's like no maintenance. Like I, I don't have to worry about you know, leaving the lights on. I don't have to worry about having to get gas and stuff. I guess I should really do keep talking to some of the other townsfolk because I will get more tips and hopefully books. Those books seem to be like lifesavers, really. Not bad. I do for you? Ask her to ask about the shipwrecks. Shipwrecks? Fortunately, there have been quite a few in recent years. Lighthouse helps, but even struggles to cut through the fog some nights. Do our best to salvage and clear wrecks that occur on this side of the island. That should make fishing a bit easier for you. Around the back, though, a little harder to get to. Sell some wrecks towards the deeper patches if you want to avoid that area. Okay. Interesting. No books. Uh, I'll head back out. We we'll got some night fishing and get some of those weird fish that go bump in the night. We got the funky smell on the surface. There, that's what I want. Here. I should say yar. I did. Stingray. Wow, these are huge. Ooh, shard ray. That looks cool. Alright, some late night fishing paid off. My god, is it dark? You can't see anything. That looks so cool, though. Hi, Captain. I swear to God, sometimes these rocks just pop out of nowhere because I think of the. I think it's it's a side effect of the panic because I know during the day those rocks don't exist. 
You got any of those mutants with you now? Yes. Remember, any aberrant will suffice. I suspect they're all the same underneath. Fishmonger takes the aberrated fish for you. Clutches it close to his chest, wringing his hands around its slimy body. Yes, this should do nicely. Here's what the fish is worth. Why don't you take these two? As no need wow, I'm just cleaning up. Do you hear that? It sounds like a faint, like the faintest whispering. You listen. Silence. In the stillness of the room, the fishmonger's hands begin to tremble. His face grows anguished. Please, sell what you need, then leave. I must deal with this creature quickly now. Uh. Oh, I got a nice chunk of change now. Goodbye. Okay, fishmonger's door slams shut behind you. Your heavy scraping of a metal bar sliding across it. Okay. <laughs> oh, okay, so I just sit there. Okay, that's okay, that makes a little bit of sense. What does my chip look like thing? Two scrap of wood. Okay, so I can get this now. Sell this, that, don't need that, and uninstall, put it into storage. I can take this, cargo, install it here. Okay, so now I have room for this. Oh, it's not more money. Fuck. <laughs> I probably would have been fine. Keeping the old. Oh no, I don't think I would have worked. Oh, maybe I could have stacked them two here and then. Okay. Well, I can catch both things now, which I think is at faster speed than. Oh yeah, either one of those were. Nice. Fifty three hundred. Interesting. <laughs> nice. Uh, with that, though, I'm going to take a quick little break. I, I'm going to keep playing this game. Uh, probably not for too much longer. Maybe like another half an hour. Then, uh, yeah, I'm loving this game. I'm going to come back for this. I'm probably going to be playing this mainly in the mornings. Uh, just because of how chill and just very calm it is. And not that that has to be morning games, but the other ones are more, you know, people want to tune in for Dark Souls. People want to tune in for Kingdom Hearts. This is like a nice little extra side dish. Anyway, I'll be right back. Okay, Bambi, kick his ass. That's it. Kick his ass. Get him. Oh, jeez. Okay, this is actually about to be useless. Absolutely useless. Get out of here, Bambi. You go all the way back out to the 100 acre wood. Oops. Donald, what the fuck? 
looks like I can. Gotta love it. How's everyone doing? Yeah, that's a... Alright. Um, some of them are full. But uh, I think mine should still be okay. Mine is still... Uh, yeah, I think they're still good. Um, I believe you will get a little notification like it says approved. We'll be, we'll be a little pop-up and you'll get uh, somewhere around here. It'll give you a token called Novice Transfer Token. Turn his eyes on it. Come on, Miracle. Come on, Miracle. Lerny, come on, I believe in you. Come on, Lerny, come on. Lerny, you magnificent bastard. Yes! <laughs> All right. Well, good news. Good what? Job. <laughs> oh, no, you found the emote. <laughs> good job. to ask which one that what button that was. Why are you now whispering them? Not bad. Good job. <laughs> nice job. Good job. Hey there. Oh. My day is complete. <laughs> My life is complete. Oh. Holy shit. <laughs> I figured I don't have anything going. Okay. Alright. Get back into it. So we just bought a rod. Uh, we're gonna save it for this one. See, so that's four. This is. I'd have to sit, but it's cheaper. But this lets me fish it. Ten per day, though. You know what? We'll, uh... You want to do night fishing? Oh, we'll rest. Fishmonger still locked in? Okay. Those are coastal? Yeah. I don't really want to go fishing. Oh, I got something on my back now. Or was that always there? The bars from the inside. I wonder if I just keep sleeping. I'm there for a little bit? Oh, okay. Might be the new rock. Oh, yeah, that's a good point. There we go. Ugh, blinding hitting today. Come by yesterday? Don't recall. Anyway, what can I do for you? All right. So I can go back out now. And that also gave my uh, crab pot some time. Oh, I was I was waiting for because if the uh, what the fuck is these guys? Ah, uh, oceanic. Um, if I couldn't sell the uh, fish, they would have gone stale and they would have gone. Ooh, wow. They would have gone less valued. Wow, this is a lot faster.
Like, I would have just sold a bunch of stale fish. Folded fish. Three headed cod. <laughs> uh... There we go. Crab. Okay. I think that's enough just for today. get like a blinding fast blinding fast engine is that a thing can you go blind by speed from speed not by speed I got enough for the thing. Interesting as I move. Okay. Oh, that's cool. What if I catch? Okay, so I still need the rod. Fish the bigger things. Uh, I should probably turn back around. <laughs> interesting. Interesting. I'm assuming the deeper it goes, the better results. Is it coast? Ah, oh, damn it. I misread it. Cool. There's a big red thing over there. Uh, maybe I shouldn't. Oh, I see. Oh, it's a separate inventory. Is it? Yeah, it is. Neat. Okay, that's actually really handy, but also counterintuitive for what I need at the moment. So this might not be great. I might end up uninstalling that. a huge what's what need to be repaired it the trawling thing needs to be repaired okay interesting yeah. let's see where, where else can we go what's another if we go immediately behind the back of this area. Dang it. 
Eldritch Cod Island, yeah. Oh, I forgot I needed to get folded fish for this. Damn it, okay. I'll have to come back for it. Unless... Oh. Stone humps quietly, sending ripples through the air around it. Faint shapes dance upon its surface, vanishing before your eyes can focus on them. Place my hand on the stone. What could go wrong? Old stone does not respond to your touch. Ooh, okay. Well, I gotta come back, huh? Ooh, another one of these guys. Oh, this is tough. Oh, I don't like this. Okay, well, I think I might get rid of that. Well, even if I replace it, I'd have to, uh, um, can I move it to the net? I guess not, huh? Just pe oh, okay, so that, that weird thing is probably where I need to... Big skeleton. See it. Ooh. Okay. What was that? I made a terrible mistake. for me oh oh my goodness is that krakens Where the hell am i oh my god uh, should i go to steel point no let's keep going it's like ding fish Hey there, buddy. That doesn't help me, does it? Nope. I 
god, I went the wrong way around. This has like, um, don't starve together vibes. Or like, don't starve. We have that sanity meter. You start seeing things, you don't uh, keep up with that. That's a fun game. That, that would be interesting to stream with friends. Wow. All right. Oh my, you look exhausted. You've not, you're not forgetting to get some sleep, are you? As I always say, take frequent breaks. It's important to being productive. I'll deal with that in a second. I, I, I saw some stuff. <laughs> this lumber? Okay. So let's just put this in the storage. As well as this. I don't know what this is, but... We gotta get our shit fixed first. Ah. No wonder we were so slow. One of our engines broke. That was exciting. Yeah. Back to the Blackstone Isle. Let me check on our uh, crab pot. How much money do we have? Oh, not enough. Ooh, caught a trophy. Nice. I do like the fact that I can just do this. And it doesn't affect the inventory, so I can just keep making money. You enter the collector's house. He's standing at the back of the room, still holding the silver and crimson book. He seems impatient. Well, you have something, don't you? Show me. You hand him the key. The cold metal shimmers, strange shine as it holds it. The shape of the key, its teeth, the head now somehow seem changed. Smaller? Has it always been this way? Is this all? Where's the lock? The collector grows agitated. It seems the pieces we're looking for traveled further than I anticipated. Much further, I suspect. In that case, allow me to aid you in travels. He turns a few pages He turns a few pages in his book and mutters something low under his breath. A burst of light fills your vision. You stagger back briefly. Oh, now go. We have more relics to uncover. So do I have nitrous at the at the at the cost of sanity? My intuition tells me that their current that the currents may have carried some of the debris to the southeast towards Gale Cliffs. Make that your priority. I'll mark I'll mark the location on your map where you can be begin your search. Anything else? What do they do to me? The book holds power from the deep. I merely extended its powers towards you. There's there one particular you wish to know more about? Haste. Oh, so you can get multiple things. Interesting. The words of haste are instant and cruel. They will impart a terrible speed on your on your vessel. Be warned, however, it may put a great deal of stress on your engines. <sighs> okay. Uh That's a lot more other stuff. But I think, I know just as it's getting good, what we'll do is we'll go back and, uh, Andy Fish, hold on. Haste adds speed to your engine, but pa causes panic at engine heat. Oh. Interesting. Boat. 
Oh, it does belong. Yeah. Let's put this. No. One. Two. Such an ominous looking island. today my housekeeper emerges from the dark forest that flanks the town she walks towards the dock with a confused look on her face mm. oh it's you what are you expecting your engine it sounded like I'm sorry I mistook it for a vessel of an old friend dejected she turns and walks back to the lighthouse <laughs> I don't know what this is or what this does, but it is taking up space. I might just get rid of it. Put it in storage for now. <clears throat> uh, I'll get everything ship shape in Bristol fashion. Okay. So often you get sketchy fish. It could, yeah. this I don't have any wood. the rest okay so now I gotta go way out of the way interesting I'm sure there's ports here I can sell fish to as well Unfortunately, for now, I'm going to call it here. Let it autosave. Maybe that's what that does. Um, yeah, I'm going to we'll have some dinner. I hope everyone else has some food ready to go. Ooh, we can change all this stuff, too. I like it. I'm going to be coming back to this. Like, whenever I find a new game, it's always like, um, I gotta. I want to put everything else on hold while I play this game. Like, I want to play this offline, but I also want to share the experience. Because, like, being chased by that thing was. I I didn't know what it was. I'm gonna have to go back and look at look at it again because it's like, okay, um, but yeah, uh, that's Dredge. I really like this game. I'm gonna be streaming it a lot more. I think, uh. Tomorrow, we're going to finish up Resident Evil 4, for sure. Uh, probably going to start in the afternoon. Maybe a little bit earlier, maybe like 3, 4 o'clock. Just so we can knock it out and uh, not worry about... Not, not so much not worry about it anymore, but... Um, then we can get back to our, our originally <laughs> scheduled programs of Dark Souls and Kingdom Hearts. Um, I have written up my list of games for... April. Uh there is no change. It's um still gonna be what do I have here? 
still gonna be Dark Souls, still gonna be Kingdom Hearts 2. Um I think I'm gonna put more of a pause on Sonic 06 as much as I want to get back into it. Um uh, maybe, you know, yeah. What I will put a pause on is Banjo kazooie. Uh dredges are gonna be added in there. Uh Pikmin 3 is another one of the mainstays I wanna get in there as well. Uh, I don't know how long it's gonna take me to beat Pikmin 3. Um Last time I played it, I played it with my brother co-op, so it, which made life a little bit easier. But uh, I mean, it's springtime. You got to play springtime vibe games. So, but Dredge will definitely be in here for a while. Um, I do need to go back and finish the Unfinished Swan. Um, I do have a game called Salamander County Public Television that I do want to play, but it, it does definitely feel like a one-off kind of game. Um, so that might be just one of those things to break up the monotony. <laughs> I, I refuse to elaborate further, but yes, there is a game called Salamander County Public Television. Um, whether or not the salamanders are part of that game, I have no idea. But, uh, yeah, the only real new addition would be, I guess, Dredge and Pikmin 3. Everything else is just going to be business as usual um that's about it inscription sea thieves in the morning that kind of thing uh yeah well i don't know what to do <laughs> who who's online that i recognize oh <laughs> yep we're gonna go see rex car again <laughs> Unless they're just, I don't know, my stomach's starting to growl. Uh, you know, what? I'm just gonna, <laughs> I'm just gonna call it here. But uh, yeah, um, hopefully I'll see you fine folks tomorrow for the end of Resident Evil Four Remas remake remaster. My God, no, it's remake. Game player, okay. Um, yeah, hopefully I'll see you fine folks tomorrow for the end of Resident Evil 4. And if not, I'll see you when I see you.